Senate Republicans held their weekly press briefing on Tuesday. Senate Minority Leader Mitch McConnell was asked about President Biden declaring that, quote, the pandemic is over. McConnell seemingly agreed with the president's sentiment. The Kentucky Republican said, quote, people are getting back to normal and leading the kind of lives they did before. That does not necessarily mean that COVID has disappeared, but I think we're all learning to live with it. President Biden has faced backlash from the left for his comments on COVID, with some saying his declaration that the pandemic is over was premature. <laughs> I called on you last week and you weren't here. Sorry, sorry. Glad to get two today. In any event, do Republicans think that there is a pandemic? And does the president need to clarify the state of where we are with this pandemic? Well, I think the, the American people have decided to get back to normal. And uh, <clears throat> you can argue, as Senator Blunt pointed out, <laughs> where we are in all of this. But I think people are getting back to normal and um, leading the kind of lives they, they did before. That does not necessarily mean that COVID has disappeared, but I think we're all learning to live with it. Leader McConnell, Leader McConnell, can I, will you support the Kigali ratification? I haven't decided. We just had a really interesting discussion about that at, uh, at our conference, and I haven't really decided. Do you have, like, factors you're weighing? No, as I said, I haven't decided. Yeah, you had said last month that you think the House is more likely to flip than the Senate. Mm -hmm. As we head into the final stretch of the campaign season here, is that still your view? Well, I've consistently said for two years now that the Senate is 50-50, the country is 50-50, and I think the outcome for the Senate is likely to be 50-50. Um, we've got a bunch of hard-fought races. Uh, we're all giving it our best on both sides, and I think it's a jump ball. David Leader McConnell, yeah. will there be 10 Republican votes for Joe Manchin's permitting reform, especially considering this is part of the IRA deal that you guys opposed? Well, I think the best answer to that is that all of us, I believe, voted for Shelley Moore Capito's permitting bill <clears throat> during the Voterama. That's the one I think that most of us feel uh, would actually make a difference. I don't think Senator Manchin has yet actually produced his bill so that you can take a look at it. Most of us would like to see genuine permitting reform. Sounds like that's kind of a red line for the Democrats. Uh, whether they would ever accept this or not is unclear. You'd have to ask Schumer. Leader, 